Hey there, everybody, this is Ryan. Welcome to Let's Play Advanced Wars Part 10. We just defeated Grit here, and now we are going to be moving on to where? I have no idea. And, ooh, Ebon Rat. I'm moving up in the world. It's about time, too, that people recognize my achievements. <laughs> okay, not going to get emotional. Huh. Andy, Max, and Special Advisor Rye, wasn't it? That's me. What's it to you? Special Forces Commander. Supposed to join you earlier. Better late than never. Infantry and Max Unit Specialists. To be honest, Sammy does have her have her advantages, and I guess I should be um, embracing each and every CO's abilities because each one of them has. Where it is, a lost force is going towards Yellow Comet. That's interesting. A new land. I should be embracing each person's individual CO abilities and strengths and weaknesses, but personally, Sammy, I'm not that big a fan. I'm going to use her just because we just got her, but... Oh, great. We're going up against Asshole. That's my name for him now. Hmm, I think I've seen those guys before. Do you remember them? Yes, I do. I'm not you, Andy. I don't forget these things. Independent Battalion. Lots of air units. So uh, this level is going to be a bitch. I'm more for vehicles. That's what I'm saying. That's why I don't use Sammy very often, and you are not going to see me using her CO power much, if at all. Especially because, considering the units that I have, I don't really have that many infantry units to begin with, so... I see no use for her, right? Use for her CO power here. Well, I guess I have four, but I'd rather have more than that if I'm going to use Sammy's CO power. I'm thinking... I'll attack these units first, obviously. Take them out of the picture. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of air units in in the weights. I just don't know it, know it yet. Uh, you guys suck. I'm sure it's going to be like one or two bombers. And I'm just going to facepalm. Yeah, and I just realized... <laughs> I just realized I had these anti-air units and I didn't use them. My bad. Strategy for this one, from what I could tell from the layout, obviously we're going to have... Pretty much every unit is going to have to go across the bridges, so... Try not to get too separated. If anything, you can use your air units to scout ahead, but not too far ahead. But I'm just going to keep my units typically on the same area of land. Like right here, this second piece of land that we're crossing over into, I'll keep all my units on this side and then move them on to the next, probably. Uh, I'm just faster on the road. On the road again! We're waging war on the road again! Uh, there we go. Defend my fighter. I love how I just use my units as shields for other units. You gotta imagine what the freaking helicopter pilots and all that are thinking. They're like, what the hell is this guy doing? And his ilk. What is that? What is that? Andy and his ilk? His comrades? Oh god, bombers. Oh god. It's my worst nightmare. And that guy's toast. Now I'm down to three infantry units left. Oh, this is not good. This is not kosher. Eh, could have been worse, I guess. Alright, can I... Yeah, he can hit him. Awesome. I love the missile units. They're probably one of the rarest units I ever deploy, period, in Advanced Wars Dual Strike, but when you have them, and the unit uses a lot of air units, hell yeah, they're useful. Main priority is to take care of the bombers. 
freaking scum! How dare you invade my land? How dare you! You know what I've been thinking? I could use these forests for cover. Yeah, this would work. I'm thinking strat strategical. I know that's not a word. I. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's only freaking 10, 11 in the morning, and it's a long. It's been a long day already. That's not a good omen for what's to come. Good, there's a tank unit. That's not fun. Shit! He has the CO power filled up entirely. And he has another freaking fighter, of course. Infantry unit number two is dead. Oh god, infantry... Oh wait, no. He's not dead yet. I was about to say. is nothing but a scratch. But of course Eagle CO power is going to allow him to have any of his vehicle units have a second turn. So I will pull no punches even though I'm going up against a girl. Um, I'm sorry that sounded sexist. This guy is more sexist than me trust me. I'm not sexist at all mind you. God, I just want to slap myself for that right now for the comment. Let's put it this way. I'm a survive I'm a reality fan junkie. And for like Top Chef or things like that, I always I always seem to root for the women more than anything and when it comes to my culinary reality shows, so Yeah. Infantry movement range for infantry and mech units. Movement cost and all terrain becomes one. Again, not seeming very useful to me. But yeah, that's, that's something I've always noticed and something that I'm cool with is that when it comes to like my reality shows, mainly cooking shows like Chopped or Top Chef and all that, I have always, always, always rooted for a majority, if not all, the women contestants in each show. And I don't know why I'm saying this, because it's totally off-tangent, but, you know, I must defend myself. I don't know, that's just in my nature. I feel bad when I say something I obviously don't mean. Well, this isn't turning out too bad. But this way, it could be worse. You could have even even more. You could have even more air units than this. But the game wouldn't be that cruel, would it? Would it? All right, let's take care of this tank unit. him up today. Hmm, who do I think is more useful? Vehicles, ground vehicles, air units, or water units? Personally, I, re I actually really like aer aerial combat. You got the bombers who can do a massive amount of damage, and you have fighters that can take care of other air units. You have the, I believe they're called the, um, wow, well, let me move my units here to more foresty areas. Just 
guy up. Uh, I just want to move him onto the mountain. These copters, they're pretty much your all-around air units. I don't know, I wouldn't mind using Eagle. He's probably one of my more favorite CEOs in Dual Strike because, oh god. Because not only does his aerial, aerial units have more firepower, but his CO power is just so good. I mean, any vehicles that you have, they'll get a second turn once you use it. And of course I'm getting owned up by him, so I'm praising my antagonist. I'm praising the antagonist of this game. It makes me a bad man. Okay, so... Two clicks east of the forest is where that other aerial, aerial unit is, so I need, to, I need to keep in mind of that. Uh, I need to get rid of this fighter unit here. There we go. And I need to have a unit highlighting or illuminating the road. Um, I have no idea. You know what, let's move this infantry unit down. Uh, let's move the tank unit. I don't know. I, I'm so... I'm half paying attention right now while, as I play this. Probably not a good idea on my part playing this when I'm half paying attention. But I seem to be doing pretty good. It's amazing, I know. I'm fantabulous. units down. Just got gotta keep moving, keep moving. Or whatever Dory from Finding Nemo says. I think it was Finding Nemo. Yes, I've watched Finding Nemo before. You're kind of you're kind of either prone or forced to watch Disney movies. When you have a five-year-old sister. Or, wait. Oh god, this is embarrassing. Um, let's see, I'm 19. There's, oddly enough, an 11-year year difference between me and my older sister, and I believe there's a... Uh, oh god, this really is embarrassing. No, she's... Somewhere in five to seven. Wow, I'm a bad brother. Technically, she's my half-sister, so... I haven't actually seen her that often, so... Wow, I'm feeling like a douche today. Might as well slap my wrist with a spoon or something. First I make a comment that wasn't intended to be sexist, but it almost came across as that, and now I can't remember my the age of my younger half-sister. Next thing you know, I'm going to forget what my social security number is. Actually, let's not go there. Damn, how many units does this guy have? Oh, uh, oh of course. He's gonna take out my mid tank unit. Please don't, please don't, please don't. Ooh, skin of my freaking teeth. Okay, finish him. Go, my beloved artillery unit. And that's the end of that chapter. 
I, Eagle, beaten by Andy again. I bet there would be different dialogue if you used Andy as your CO. I think I'll take offense at your mistake. Do I look like a boy to you? Alright, here it, here it comes. I got lost to a girl? See? This guy is sexist. Ooh, and she just owns him up. I would like to apologize for my behavior. It was... What? I vow by my lucky goggles. Now I will take my leave for it. Oh, now he's being polite? What the hell did Andy do? It seems that he has this grudge against Andy, but when it comes to somebody else, all of a sudden is happy, happy. Oh well. I win! But what's going to happen once we cross over into Yellow Comet territory? Find out next time in Let's Play Advance Wars. I am Rai, and I will see you guys very soon. Happy gaming!